What's up? It's Christmas Stone Fox Media. And lots of interesting gaming news right now. Tons of stuff is going on. Uh, just recently found out that Battlefield Hardline is 900p on PS4 and 720p on Xbox One. Now, I know what you're going to say. Xbox One is a piece of shit. But no, it's not. It's not. It just looks like a piece of shit. That's the only problem. Okay, the ashiest game just got a whole lot ashier. Uh, Battlefield Hardline uh, developer Visceral Games has confirmed resolution for PlayStation 4 and Xbox One versions of the upcoming Cops and Robbers game. And yes, it will be 900p native on PS4 and 720p on Xbox One. And everyone knows the PC version is probably going to be the best. It's going to be super awesome, but uh, I hate PC. But that's okay. I know a lot of people are pissed off right now, and I know the Xbox fanboys are going to try and find some way to spin this. They're going to bust out DirectX 12 like it's going to come. Like, DirectX 12 is going to make this not look like ass. It's not going to work. Okay, so you can talk about the exclusives. There's lots of games coming out this year, except for maybe one. Uh... There's a rumor going on right now that uh, Quantum Break is likely going to be delayed until 2016. Uh, Dutch Xbox social media community coordinator uh, said it's likely to delay until 2016. Uh, there's not much information regarding this whole entire rumor, but yes, it has come from someone on the inside. And he tweeted that, you know, it's some bad news. It's likely delayed till 2016. And, you know, uh, Day Jim came out and said, uh, just trying to clarify because, you know, uh, it's becoming a rumor. I can't confirm it myself. Please wait for official PR from Microsoft. So it looks like this game is not going to be coming out this year. So a lot of people were looking forward to it. I was looking forward to it. It looks amazing. If they had to delay it till next year to make it look awesome and not be 720p, I would greatly appreciate it because I really don't want an ashy-ass screen. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't want to look at this ashy game if it's going to be ashy. So clean it. Wipe it down and then give it to us in 2016 if that's what's necessary. There's plenty of games coming out this year. There's plenty. Just not that many for the Xbox One. I know Ori and the Blind Forest is not going to be able to compete with Bloodborne. I've not heard anything negative about Bloodborne yet because we all know we were hearing negative things about the Order last year. Damn near. Okay, so no, this is this is not great news for Microsoft right now. This is, this is looking pretty bad. But there is good news right now. Uh, 50,000... Fans of Call of Duty have petitioned uh, for Modern Warfare 2 on PS4 or on Xbox One Remake. So uh, a lot of people love, you know, Modern Warfare 2. It was a great game. I did love it myself. And uh, there's been a petition right now on Change.org uh, by Ramirez Zahara of Australia. And, uh, yeah, he requested, uh, you know, that they bring this game back and bring it to, to PS4 and Xbox One because people love it. Now, he said it's probably not the best one. Uh, you know, Modern Warfare is a better or whatever and all this other good stuff. And I'm like, you know what? I like this whole entire petition right now because, to be honest, I don't really like this jetpacks Call of Duty way that they're going. I don't want to go back to World at War with muskets and stuff. I don't want to rob stagecoaches. I'm sorry. I'm just not down with it. But I would love if they did like some kind of crazy Halo Master Chief collection without the suckiness uh type of thing or whatever where they had like a remake of modern warfare modern warfare 2 and then black ops and black ops 2 if they could pull this off you would literally like bring all these people back to call of duty because call of duty was awesome then and now it's just i don't know what the hell it is okay but please try and bring these games back i would play it and if you'd be even more awesome if you found a way to let us bring our old data from our ps4s and xbox ones and bring our stats with us oh man come on tell me you wouldn't play it tell me you wouldn't buy it well, that's all the news I got for you guys today. Like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter and Facebook so you know as soon as my news becomes available. Thank you guys for watching, and I will holler at y'all later.